Hey everybody, welcome back to Cluster Fox Bend in Minds channel where I talk about dream and I also do a dream journal or journal dream blog actually and I'm also up I'm going to be uploading videos Mondays and Thursdays and also I'll be uploading videos that falls the date of either um any any type of date that is like the 9th 19th and the 29th because they signify a great 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 old greater deal for me uh the number nine and i explain i'll explain it more once i get in tune with my why number nine but the topic for today would be alligator because I, I was dreaming about alligator that scared me like a lot and it's nine interpretations so number one this dream is trying to alert you and enemies around you to around you around to hurt you be very cautious in any venture number two if you kill an alligator in your dream it would be good for you which gives you great luck good omen omen number three to be bitten by this animal denotes that you need to make sure you stop worrying worrying as things will sort themselves out number four a bad very bad omen number five a big mouth a big mouth person who makes sh sharp or biting comment is trying to bring you down literally number six someone will attack you personally someone around you you can't be trusted so be cautious number seven if the alligator ambush you it means that their danger is lurking around you so do be careful Number eight, it means that you need to improve or encourage your financial security. Number nine, the crocodile is chasing you or hunting you in a dream means that you are going to discover many attributes about yourself on a psychic level. That's very interesting. So those are the nine interpretation of what it means to dream about crocodile so my dream about the crocodile if you you know listen to one of the dream blog um, the second one so after going back to sleep I come into my dream when I was walking around then I spotted something in the water surrounded by grass it was an alligator and I keep watching it I must have disturbed it and it came following me and tried to bite me so I climb out at the electric post but it keep, still keep getting me so I walk more and climb up another thing which so I walk more and climbed up another thing which it looked like a bunch of paint cans placed around the corner of the street which was really weird I climb on top of it and the alligator jumps to try to grab me I keep trying to throw paint cans at it and it gets blinded after that the alligator stops following me following me then my dream changes to something peaceful I can't remember it though since Facebook notification woke me up and I forgot to silence it so overall my dream was interesting I felt afraid kind of not because I was fighting back and also there are some cues um, like I said not like I said there's you know the alligator the paint the water grass and the feeling that I was having and when I came into and search from all the books that I bought it, it means terrible things nothing really positive it's just terrible things and with Artemidorus, the old, old book that I bought does not pertain anything about alligators. 
so which is weird i don't know if it exists in the past past 19 um, where the um when was the 19 1975 no more beyond that beyond um 1975 where artemi doros used to live in his lifetime but it doesn't have any allegories in it so that's all my interpretation with this alligator and like i said mondays and thursdays i'll be uploading videos so that's it for today and if you guys have any comments comment below if you have any other interpretation how you think about your dreams and if you guys have any situation in your dreams where you're too scared to confront the alligator comment below so that's it for today and i'll talk more on thursday i'm sorry it's kind of short with my interpretation and also talking because i'm kind of like tired but i did research this prior to you know talking to you guys so because all the books that I've been ready, uh, reading were kind of like negative, not nothing so special. <laughs> so there, there should be another positive about it since I was fighting back. So I felt bravery, you know, in my present time. I've been looking around and see if there's any going on. Like it would kind of freak me out about the interpretation. So I was just like tr mistrusting anybody around me, everybody around me. So it was giving me anxiety. But that is all for today. And like I said, I'll be uploading Mondays and Thursday. And thank you for listening. Have a great sleep. And bye.